Hello all the young people and other partners of Francesco's economy. My name is Ariel Molina and I am from Brazil. I am a bachelor in agroecology, specialist in biodynamic farming, master in horticulture and currently a PhD student in botany at INPA, the National Amazonian Institute of Research. My research is about indigenous food security, edible fruits and edible insects from the jungle. But apart from my academic engagement, I am also part of CSA's social movement, represent CSA Brazil Network and Urgency, the international CSA network. CSA are the initials for community-supported agriculture, where a group of consumers have a long-term partnership with farmers for producing local food, where the risks, the responsibilities and the benefits of agriculture are shared with both parts. CSA is about sharing the harvest and much more, and are a great alternative for family farmers. Since 2013, I am an activist at CSA Movement in Brazil, helping on training programs in CSA for farmers and consumers. The CSA Movement started in the early 80s and the farms of tomorrow are now shining more than ever. In 2018, I helped to set the first CSA in Amazonia in parallel with my PhD at the, at the city of Manaus and today we are the first sustainable economic matrix on organic and family farming in the heart of the rainforest. CSA Manaus is a member of HEMA, Moniva Agroecology Network, and we are transforming the only organic farmers market in Manaus into other CSAs and also selling through online producers store as a response of the pandemic. I am also trying to set a long distance CSA with Brazil nuts, known as Castanha do Pará, Costanha da Amazônia, directly from indigenous land in the rainforests to urban centers like Brasilia, our capital and also Sao Paulo city. And a pilot was successful during the, the pandemic. There are fishermen families in Amazonia which are interested in having a closer approach to the economic models of CSAs. As a member of Abraci, Brazilian Insect Growers Association, we can tell that even insects can be used for human food and feed for livestock. All of these shows our biodiversity are the key for a solidarity economy, which preserves the forest and the farmers, the people which take care of earth and its traditional ecological knowledge. I call here for other young people from Francisco's Economy, which works, works with CSA, to come together and make part of this team at Agriculture and Justice Village, and also for others which would like to contribute contribute and develop our peasant farming and also our forestries. There is hope in Brazil. There is hope in Amazonia. Thank you.